torsion dystonia, a form of dystonia known as early onset torsion dystonia also called idiopathic or generalized torsion dystonia that begins in childhood around the age of 12. Symptoms typically start in one part of the body, usually in an arm or leg, and eventually spread to the rest of the body within about five years. Early onset torsion dystonia is not fatal, but it can be severely debilitating. Most children with the disorder are unable to perform the simplest of motor tasks and are confined to a wheelchair by the time they reach adulthood. Torsion dystonia, a form of dystonia known as early onset torsion dystonia also called idiopathic or generalized torsion dystonia that begins in childhood around the age of 12. Symptoms typically start in one part of the body, usually in an arm or leg, and eventually spread to the rest of the body within about five years. Early onset torsion dystonia is not fatal, but it can be severely debilitating. Most children with the disorder are unable to perform the simplest of motor tasks and are confined to a wheelchair by the time they reach adulthood. Torsion dystonia, a form of dystonia known as early onset torsion dystonia also called idiopathic or generalized torsion dystonia that begins in childhood around the age of 12. Symptoms typically start in one part of the body, usually in an arm or leg and eventually spread to the rest of the body within about five years. Early onset torsion dystonia is not fatal, but it can be severely debilitating. Most children with the disorder are unable to perform the simplest of motor tasks and are confined to a wheelchair by the time they reach adulthood.